Maybe they left the note. They wanted others to follow. Clara, Maximas Matanzas was definitely at the fort. There's signs of a gunfight and shit thrown everywhere. That sounds like them. Can you pick up their trail? See, they won't be hard to track. That's what I'm worried about. Rapido, Danny. They tried to run with that? <sighs> Idiotas. Pinga. So much vinyl. Hey, you! Lower hey, that weapon! you! Help me out! Gracias. You got it. Blessing. Amen, Oku. Bad music. Must be Maximas Matanzas. Cojone. I'm not the first to find them. Inga. Hope I'm not too late. Hostages. Clara. I think I found Maximas Matanzas' hiding spot. The Castillo soldiers got here first. Looks like they're having some fun before they call for backup. Your orders. What are you doing? Fuck those guys up! That's the last of them. Italia. Move. What the fuck? <sighs> hey, uh, you think I could keep this? No, yes. Hey, 
Hey, man, you just saved Maximus Matanzas, the most blessed motherfucking group in Yara. Well, I would have done it myself personally, but you know, I couldn't stop crying. Get out of my way. I'm Bicho, man. I'm from Mexico. Get me the fuck out of here. I know you can hear me. If I let you out, you're gonna be half? Mi amor. Fuck you, Talia. Oh, I thought you wanted to hide like a pussy ass bitch. You want to die before we get to America? Oh, big man, Paolo. So a real man takes care of his chica by hiding her in a stank ass swamp. Fucking puta. <laughs> Coño. Oh, that's just foreplay. <laughs> Okay, okay. You guys ever heard of Libertad? Clara Garcia sent me. Shh. We were Libertad before Libertad. Who do you think dragged Clara to her first protest when she wanted to live in a fucking library? I don't care. Clara knows her boring ass speeches won't convince Yarns to join Libertad. She needs her voice. Don't worry, Talia's full of shit, and so are you. Welcome to Camp Maximus. <laughs> They're animals. Everybody! Soldados are gone! Come on out! Clara, good news? Maximus Matanzas is safe, and they've actually got a decent camp here. Bad news? They don't give a shit about Libertad. Give it time, Danny. They've been through a lot. We can't beat Castillo without Talia's voice and Paolo's discipline. You just need to help them find it. Okay, Clara. I'm gonna trust You know what the hell you're getting me into. <laughs> You're still full of shit. A lot more people here than I thought. Are the musicians too? Talia collects dreamers dumb enough to pick fights with Anton's Ministry of Culture. I just make sure they aim the barrel away from the face. Thought I was the only dropout. Thought I was a drill instructor. Family's fifth gen army until me. What happened? Expelled. When Papa found out I turned from his favorite daughter into a freak. His words. Shit. Just trans in the military, compai. I was lucky. Talia caught me trying to steal her gear, but instead of turning me in, she gave me a deck. Libertad can help all of you here. Libertad? When Castillo won, we left riots with Clara. And what did he get us? Clara runs off to play guerrilla, Talia gets thrown into Maria Marquesa's bullshit academy, and I have to take a big fucking debt to get her out. From who? Bembe, black market smuggler. Once he's paid off, Talia and I are off this fucking rock. Let me take some debt, Paolo. I don't do handouts. Okay. Why'd you leave the military? Punch my drill instructor in the throat. I'm not a morning person. Segunda. Bembe deals in the church. a weapon shipment. American. Interested? Interested? Danny, I'm having a hands-free orgasm in this church. Call me when you find them. Gross. Uh, yeah, okay. Give me the Danny. Talia. 
So now you want to talk to me? No, I want to see him. Meet me at the zoo while about it all. The ride that whips you around. Look, if this is some kind of fucked up date... Just get that ass over here. And don't tell Paolo. He'll drag me back to that fucking swamp. But I've done so many bad things. Clara, I need, to I need to help Paolo pay off a debt to some black market smuggler named Bembe. Do whatever it takes, Danny. If Paolo was able to build that camp on the run, imagine what he could do for Libertad when he decides to fight. Understood, Clara. <clears throat> You Bembe? I know a silly when I see one. What's wrong with Ola, asshole? Try to fuck me, Danny Rojas. I sell your organs to the Yankees. And I know if I shoot you, Paolo's death disappears. No. You have rules. You might kill, but you're no killer. Mierda, you got me. So what does that make you? I kill guerrillas. I also kill soldiers. It's just business. Easy to pretend you're not picking sides. My father was a guerrilla in 67. After the revolution, he put on a crisp military uniform. Thirty years later, to his surprise, a fresh new revolution with fresh new guerrillas. They thank him with a bullet to the skull. Buried in the same crisp uniform. Are you ready for your uniform, Rojas? It goes both ways. How's that? You were just dressed like a priest. <laughs> I like you, Danny Rojas. We can do business. Fucking Bambe. I heard those criminal propagandists, the ones from the riot in Esperanza, are okay, hiding from the swamps. I need you to pick up my key from my business partners. Where are they? At the hotel. My associates are named Dimitri and Vasily. They're Russian and they're twins. I'll make it easy and send a picture. You're too kind. They say kindness is the lowest form of manipulation. This is a simple job, Rojas. Get me my key and Paolo will thank you. I don't want Paolo's thanks. I want Paolo's debt cleared. We all do, Ross. Me most of all. Right. I'll get you this key. But then you and Paolo are square. Understand? Love you, Ross. Bye-bye. Might be? Hey, I'm just trying to help you. You don't help people, Bembe. You use them. I'll take that as a thank you.
I see you, sniper. <laughs> if those animals got out, there would be real chaos. What do you want? Are you Dimitri or Vasily? Dimitri? Who the fuck are you? Bembe sent me. Where's the key? <laughs> so that's what this is about. Bembe fucked us good. First he sends military, then he sends you. I don't work for Bembe. I'm just here for the key. My brother has the key. The soldiers drowned him like a dog, but he didn't once beg for his life. He died in that fancy pool, like a man. My Vasily. Gracias. I'm sorry about your brother. I'm getting out of here. You should too before Bende stabs you in the back. Idiota Kusok! I never should have come to this godforsaken country! Bembe, you fucking hijo de puta. Hmm. So you got my key. See, I found it on your dead Russian friend. Now, Rojas. The key opens the safe at Via Hudia Hotel. I need the black book inside. What's in that book? For you? Power is freedom. Looks like the hotel, and what a surprise. The army is here. Bembe, I'm at the hotel, and so is the army. But I think you already knew that. It's the delicious little surprises that make life worth living. Save me your bullshit. Let me guess, you want me to take them out. <laughs> you see, this is why I like you, Rojas. Don't kill the soldiers from me.
The safe's in the restaurant. Bembe, it's done. I got your book. Muy bien, Rojas. I can see why Clara has so much faith in you. You are such a good little gopher. Is that what you think I am? Prove me wrong. I don't have to prove anything to you. Tell me where to meet you. I'm across the north bridge of the hotel. All this for a book? ¿Qué tal, Rojas? Thank you for securing my new port. Thought you wanted the book from the safe. Can the man have both? Of course, the Ahudia Hotel is the real prize jewel. It's the best smuggling port on the south coast. You just needed someone to clear out the competition. The Russians make good money from this place. And with this book of corrupt officials in their pay, that money will now flow to me. We are done here. But you and I still have business to do, Rojas. You've paid off some of Paolo's debt, but not all. Don't worry. I have more work for you. What do you want, Picho? Nothing. No, that's wrong. It's definitely something. I promise. Meet me back at the camp. I got an idea. Bye!
About time. Need you to do some dead drops for the cause. You drop off the vivido, I pick up the profits. Who are the drops for? You try these? I took one for research, now I can't stop. Turn my piss purple. You want one? No. Who's paying us for the vivido, Juan? Before we slit Castillo's throat, we should ask for more flavors. It's the Yankees. Worse. CIA. The fucking CIA is in bed with Libertad? What's Clara think of this? Well, if she knew, I would hope it'd be something like, Thanks, Juan. I'm so happy to have guns to kill fascists named Castillo. Etc., etc. Freedom costs money. Clara doesn't ask. And I'll never tell. It's a private club. Just you, me, and lighthouses filled with Anton's candy. Clara needs to stay shiny. For the people. You're protecting her. I'm not so sure I'm the only one looking out for Clara. Just remember... After La Revolución, she won't have time for a guerrilla like you. Just in case. That's the spirit, guerrilla. If I say yes, I feel like you are still going to tell me. Fucking drug lords want to stash their cash in American real estate so they can launder it. Fifty million dollar deal, Danny. That's great, Juan. I even got them to throw in a few kilos of product. Sold it on the black market, but... Lost it all at the tables in Monte Carlo. How is this helping me right now? Nah, I get lonely. Suerte!
Despiértate. ¿Mm? Despiértate. I had hope for Clara. But I got you. You thought I wouldn't notice Libertad selling my dinero to the Yankees? You're a dead man. When the Garillas arrested my family in 67, me, Papa, was dragged to this very cell. I was put in the cell next door. 13. Like you, mijo. We used to talk every single night through this vent. I loved it. His voice taught me to be strong, to be a man. And then the Garillas came. Every day I'm in charge. Oh. Yeah. Crime by crime, piece by piece he paid to the Garillas. But we would still talk every single night. <laughs> Until they took his tongue for his lies to Yara. Stop! Papa, stop this! Who is this girl here to you? Ah, I think we should skip a few steps, Raul. Viva Libertad. The attack. The Hotel Paraiso. Danny was there. You... You told me that you hid in the tunnel. Danny could have killed me. Could have given me to Libertad. We have no time for lies. I've stopped running. I've listened. I've learned. I've done everything you have asked. I will be El Presidente. Let Danny go. I am not a monster, Diego. We will give them a chance. First package dropped off. Okay, good. Hey, did I tell you about the time I broke the deal for Gorbachev? Let me guess. You made the deal. Took a cut for yourself. Lost it in a dumb bet you can't even remember. I mean, yes. I think this means we are family now. Diego, not fuck. Castillo's a fucking psychopath. Something. 